the octopus is one of the most recognisable creatures. They're known for having eight arms and being able to squeeze into small places. A well-known defence mechanism these creatures use is to squirt ink at potential predators. Many people aren't aware that the blue-ringed octopus is one of the ocean's most interesting but lethal creatures. These tiny creatures have been called the chameleons of the sea. The blue-ringed octopus is also extremely venomous. It's only about the size of a human hand, but the toxins found in the bite of the blue-ringed octopus can kill a full-grown man. For self-defence they use the same toxins found in pufferfish. However, a full-grown blue-ringed octopus has enough venom to kill 26 adult humans at the same time. Worryingly, there's no antidote to the blue-ringed octopus toxin, so those that suffer a bite should seek out a hospital immediately. Over the years, these creatures have fascinated researchers. Recently, scientists have discovered that octopus squid and other cephalopods evolve completely differently from every other organism on the planet. Scientists have always known these creatures were a bit different, but a recent study has shown that some species are able to edit their RNA sequence on demand. This is to help to adapt to their environment. This has baffled some researchers. When an organism changes, it starts with a genetic mutation. This can be due to change in the DNA of said animal. These changes are then put into place by RNA. Going back to the study, it was discovered that a squid had edited over 60% of RNA in its nervous system. This meant this creature was able to adapt to whatever it wanted at any given time. It's like us being able to adapt to living in the desert and then living in the Antarctic in a matter of seconds. This study also showed researchers that octopus and cuttlefish can do the same thing. Another incredible find has also come from the ocean. The scarlet jellyfish is an incredible species that's able to restart their life. When they've sustained damage, they make their way to the ocean floor and turn themselves back into a juvenile form of a jellyfish. After this, they'll spend around three months growing back into an adult. After this, they'll carry on their life until they get injured again. Incredibly, researchers have witnessed one jellyfish performing this cycle 12 times. Due to the immortal jellyfish's capability of biological immortality, pharmaceutical research has taken an interest in this creature. It could mean that sometime in the future we'll be able to harness this ability. Some people have put forth the theory that the octopus doesn't come from this planet, and that perhaps its eggs travel to our planet via an asteroid. Although this sounds far-fetched, the shield shrimp's eggs are able to last for many years. They lay eggs and if the conditions aren't right they'll stay unhatched for up to 7 years. When there's a right amount of water the thousands of eggs will come to life. So do you think the octopus comes from another planet? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more videos.